energy vibration reading for the Ophius Sun Moon Horizon sign. Um, this is the last week of February 2019, and I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Please like, share these videos. The love reading is out, so go check out your love readings and see what's happening for the rest. The month of readings are going to be out on Monday, and I want to say thank you for the wonderful energy vibration. And please like and share these videos. Um, the week is an emotional week for you guys, but some positive, some um, it's a bittersweet week because we have the energy of celebration than debt. So some of the latest four to five years and older could be celebrating or connecting with someone. Um, the four of cups is here. Um, some of you have some regrets, and transition is coming in, and news is going to be coming in from um, the Queen of Pentacles um, and you're going to be protecting yourself from this person so uh, whoever is and whatever is happening you're definitely um, protecting yourself from this person whoever this person is uh, um definitely you're protecting yourself so it could be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn whatever the situation is is that you decide to protect yourself from this person um you decide that this person has uh, um you know that this person have been lying and you give them the chance to come clear and they never come clear and they're eating up your energies and you're going to just block the person for good and you know you don't even have to block the person just don't pick up the calls anymore that's it you know whatever let, let the person just um, find out their own bullshit that they're doing okay so um four of Pentacles is here for you um, of your sister Amensa, and it have to do with your financial stability um, some um, four 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 and so um, your angels and guides are going to be protecting you and a lot of things are going to be aligned and you're going to be seeing positive energies so um, whatever that is transpiring whatever that is happening um, you are going to be coming out it's a very emotional week there's um, a lot of information information you're going to make some transition in your life where you no longer want to deal with certain aspects and certain things okay all right, the Queen of Wands, Lady 45, um, 45 years and older this week, is from the 25th until the 3rd of March. The week is an Earth week. Zodiac energy is water. You can see all these emotions and situations. So, latest 45 years and older, what is going to be happening for you guys in this week? You are going to be protecting yourself. Whatever is happening, you latest 45 years and older, you're standing guards and is ready for anything. You could have a situation with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn but you're standing guards and is ready for anything from this person so that could be a situation that, that is happening then um, we have the energy of listen to your intuition your intuition is right and target about this person listen to your intuition your intuition is right and target about this person now the energy of the three of cups is here whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring with the energy of the three of cups let's see what is going on and what is transpiring um um, uh, whatever the celebration is um, some of you could be celebrating the ending of hardship with your financial situation some of you are really um, celebrating the ending of hardship with your financial situation the three of cups is here and um, some lies there's a lot of people that is talking some lies and deception lies and deception okay the four of cups energy is that you have regrets over a situation you really have some regrets over a situation whatever it is um, you have some regrets but you have a strong foundation and there is nothing into four of cups and the five of swords the four of cups and the five of swords what is the same for you guys is that you have to make a decision you definitely have to make a decision whatever the situation is um, some of you are thinking about and planning and trying to make a decision and the decision what you're planning and trying to make is to let go of the situation and move on the energy of debt is here um, and it's debt with uh, um, the four of cups keep on coming up so 
um, you know, a transition is coming in. A transition is definitely coming in for you guys. Okay, so some of you have been planning and hoping and wishing, and this transition is really coming in for you guys. Whatever the situation is, this transition is really coming in for you guys, and this is going to be good. Oh my god, it's as if the angels are protecting you guys in this week. It's all about the fours. So some of you were in a resting period now. Um, you were planning and now you're in a resting period and transition is going to be happening. So um, this is good. Okay, news, fastness is going to be happening. A lot of news, a lot of information. Could be text messages, but I'm not feeling that. I'm just feeling that things are just going fast. Things are just going fast. Things are just going fast, okay? And uh, um, you're going to be receiving news um, from the Queens of Cups, whoever this person is. Let's see what news is going to be coming in from this person. Okay? News from the Queen of Cups. What news is coming in about from this person? Oh, it's going to be positive news. This person is going to give you some fate and hope. Okay, so wonderful positive news that is going to be coming in. Um, this person could be speaking positive about you or just giving up. Um, giving you positive um, news and support okay the Queen of Pentacles is here it could be mothers because um, this week is showing up in a lot of energies for the mothers um, if you're a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn if your mom is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn or um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius the moms are or hair in this week a lot of situation um, that is happening the Queen of Pentacles is here whatever the situation is the energy of the Queen of Pentacles um, there is some regrets that you have with this energy of the Queen of Pentacles whoever she is let's see why you have some regrets and I think some of you have some regrets because you know this person has been honest and you, you know you give them the chance to be honest um, the Queen of Pentacles is going to help you but help you in what in what way because somehow whoever this um, Queen of Pentacles is you had some regrets um, about her and whatever the reasons that you have the regrets about her there is definitely a situation where <coughs> you thought she could have done you know or whatever is happening so be careful um the um the night nine night of nine of ones is here and the nine of ones is that you're 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 being protected your work um, you're being protected and there are people who have your back okay there, there are definitely people out there who has your back um, it could be this person um, this it could be your mom that your mom is really supporting you and she has your back but there is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn out there who really has your back in a situation you have some regrets about her and now um, you're seeing the energy of the six of Pentacles that she's going to try and help you okay some of you um, you know <laughs> um, you know you're you're protected and your financial stability even though it doesn't look as if you know it's um you know you, you, you're it's, it's as if it doesn't look as if um, it is that good and that sort of a thing but you know things are going to be working out don't take life so serious you know I always say to people don't take life so serious and that is true because when you sit and you take life serious you can't see what is there and what is about to come okay because you're so worried you're blocking whatever is there and whatever is supposed to come so be aware of that so just give it a chance let it go find time find space and um let go and let God it is really a week for you guys to let go and let God stop worrying about your tomorrow because your tomorrow um, it's going to be working out for you so stop working about your worries about your tomorrow because your tomorrow will work out for you uh, now we're going to be looking 
at these cards. We have card one and card two. Let's see what's happening. Card one, we have the crow spirit, and it's a co-create with spirit. Crow create with spirit. Number 17, the energy of the star twice for you guys. So if you choose this card, um, spirit is going to be working with you in alignment in this week. And that means your guiding angels, your mighty I am present self, and all the wonderful angels and guiding angels is going to be working on your behalf with you to um, a balanced situation. Then if you choose card two, you have the infinite spirit, and it says, life is um, beating you okay and this is really good I love this this is like the dare energies I love this um, animal spirit um, guide these things that is coming up it is wonderful it is positive it is good alignment with wonderful energies that is coming up and I want to say to each and every person um, you of your sis go listen to the love readings the monthly readings are going to be coming out soon and I want to say namaste until next time